Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of... Neighborhood, sorry. I was in here for a moment. <sighs> Posted. Do not feed or touch the wildlife. That seems to scream. I don't know. You go to the woods like socialize with word words, I guess. There's some folks living up in the cabin. You can uh, feed and touch them if you want. Weird old place up here. That's all kind of weird stuff back up in the park. All this stuff's just hanging out in the woods. We'll hit my old scout camp on the way up, I think. Busy woods. Okay, better get going before it gets dark. He is slow. I hate it. Can I go slow? Yes, I can. Buff, buff. You alright? Yeah, I got asthma as well. Sorry, you gotta wait for me. Do you have any hammer? Yeah, but I saved it that. Mm -hmm. Being slow is an emergency. What is it? This is like lime kiln, I think. Limes. Limes? Limestone. You like do something with it in there. And it comes this other thing. Oh. Limestone is weird because it's mostly made of skeletons of the sea creatures. From millions of years ago. So like this was like underwater or something at one point. No way. I mean rocks don't die. Like, right where we were standing, there used to be like ancient horrible sea monsters. Keep it awesome. That's history. Okay, ready to go. We Walk slow with... I forgot his name. Why did I forget his name? Buff buff. You. You take a break? Okay, I'm okay. No prob. Uh, uh, so if this place was underwater. Where, where did the water go? I don't know. To the ocean, I guess. And like the earth is sh always shifting, so mountains get pulled up, pushed up. Where it used to be like just flat ground. Weird because things are always boring. Nowadays, to think like this. Oh, I skipped it. I'm sorry. There's always more weird stuff that's happened. To find out about later. Okay, I'm ready to go. Cool, cool. No. Yes. This is like the third one we've passed. Buff, 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 please. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. Have. Sorry. Buff, buff, excuse me. Fine. Hang for a minute. Okay, should know all this stuff about like ancient sea creatures, rock or whatever. Lime buffs down. I was going to take a class in dinosaurs back in school. Cool. What happened? It was all full up. That class fills up fast. That. That's like the most interesting animals. You know they had feathers, or some of them. You know, right? Big freaky chickens. Things were so scary and cool back then. We died in like five minutes. Oh, yeah, ancient creatures would eat us no problem. 
Do that for the millions of years between us. Weird. Time, dude. Time makes most dangerous things less dangerous. Most things, at least. Okay, you ready to go? Yeah, we're almost at the top. Jump, 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 And it's dark. Well, that was a hike. That was a lot easier when I was 11. We passed, what, three gates on the way up here? I lost count. Weird. Used to be open back then. Hmm. There you go. Not far now, just up ahead. Jump, jump, jump. That don't think you're probably honest. Most thing, like, the most interesting thing that I find interesting in the game is the jumping mechanic. You know, the j different jumping heights and whatnot. Grace, huh? Yeah, these were, uh, were, I forgot. They were involved in the Possum Massacre. That was, like, labor strike thing. Where it was, like, the Miners versus National Guard. What happened back in town, like, a hundred years ago. Why are they up here? I think these were some of the bad guys, some of the miners. They want them buried in town. Oh, huh. There's like a few old graves up here from like colonial times. I guess there's one up here somewhere too. Well, that's spooky. It just bones. It just truck bones. I see nothing left for it to be scary. Like, like, not in smoke. Like, certain games have, like, certain jump heights. Wow, we were, wow, we were up really high. Very far out. I can't see town from here. South of us, behind whatever ridge that is. So what, are we just supposed to sit... And you tell me, you're the expert. I guess we just wait here and see if anything happens. Nice night, yeah. Back at school, I couldn't see any as many cars. That always made me sad. Oh yeah, they're really nice up here. I wish I knew the constellations like you do. What? You know the names and stories of st and stuff. I wish I could never remember them. Other than, I think the one up there is a bell or something. No, uh, no. Uh, remember that time we were all at the longest night bonfire? We could spot the constellations together. And you told us all about them. That's not a thing that happened. Well, maybe it was like a dream or something. I barely remember now. <laughs> I wonder what it, what fake constellations and stories you dreamed up. Okay, humor me. I'll find the constellation. You tell me about them. Okay, then. <sighs> right, find some constellations. Wait, are those going to be real ones or fake ones? Just ones I remember. Or rimmed that one time. Ah, uh, or which hour? Um, which hour? Yeah, science teacher. He lives in Underhill and has a telescope in his roof. And I totally saw some stories to it. That's cool. Telescope is cool. We had a telescope. Let's see. Mm. Oh. Mm. What? You there. Okay, not you there. You there? No, there, there, here, there we go. It's a Pope, it means fire. Oh, this one is real, at least to do this. Fellow, there was a statue of, a statue of him outside church. Oh, we never, we never went there. You find we'll go to church, weddings and funerals, and no, no, it's night basically. And those, I don't think those first two count. Like, those are the, like events. My mom works at a, up at a church now. I haven't gone really since I was like 14 or 15. I haven't trouble reading. 
Does she mind? She pretends not to. And one or near each other, basically. Is this like a bell or something? No. It's a cat. Because I, I was taken. And he's chasing the diamond. I don't know, this one doesn't know his name. He said, uh, you remember the stories about the fourth god? And then, yeah. My grandma, granddad used to tell me stories. Oh, okay. Anyway, this cat was in there. Like, strengthening was good getting through the forest. But it was pretty good stealing things. Oh, wow. Yeah, I used to call him Butt Cat when I was little. Yeah, and then he stole a diamond from King and got an arrow to get death. He was slick enough that he jumped out of his body and became immortal or something. Eh, decent. Should be decent. Okay, another one! And this one to here. This one to here. No. Eh, bell. That's about all. In the middle is uh, this eye looking at you. Oh, that's uh, I know this one from little Prague rock album covers. I think the world ends when it rains. That makes sense. It's gonna be really loud. There's no sound in space. I mean, like basically no sound usually. That sounds really scary for some reason. Well, at least it means. You're not going to get wrong to get to death by a bell. Okay, another constellation. Let's see. This one to this one. This one's down here. Oh, I think this one's the whale. I think. I'm not the center. It's pretty big. Yeah, it's the whale. It's a whale. And it has like world on his back. Oh well that's sad. Yeah. Kind of a lot of responsibility. Did this real con- did the real consent to this? I think it was just always like that way. Oof. You gotta wonder why people make these up. I mean, like, these specifically. Who saw a whale and was like, need to carry- need to be carrying something? <sighs> I mean... Whales are pretty big. But what's the whale swimming in? Space? I guess it's dumb to get mad at ancient people. We're like way out here, huh? In the park? Yeah, I guess. Spooky. I don't know, it's pretty safe. And the stars are pretty. So, you don't believe in ghosts at all? Mm, I do. Yeah, I don't. Don't believe in ghosts or gods or psychic powers or anything like that. What do you like? What do you guys believe in? <laughs> yeah. I know I don't believe in God, but I do believe in ghosts. I mean, there's no evidence for them, and people really have tried. Do you? Did you ever? Yeah, when I was a kid. Tell me about it. So, uh, I don't know how much I ever told you, or how much Greg has told you, but I don't didn't have the best childhood. Yeah, I think I heard that. Why was it bad? Uh, my dad didn't like me. My mom didn't either. And like, uh... You don't have to talk about it if you don't want to. I don't know why he does this. Going back to Red Horse from this one. No, it's fine. My dad used to hit me a lot. Your mom was probably worse. She like wouldn't feed me, which is why I, I really like cooking now. <laughs> she like shoved me into the pantry and sh sh slammed the door shut, and the stuff would follow the shelves on top of me. Oh, God, I guess I didn't know at all. It's awful. She locked me in there for like a day at times or overnight. So. I like to try. I like to try to develop psychic powers, so I so I could like see the most of the neighbors or next door. Didn't work as as you might guess. 
He doesn't tell anyone? I never did. I don't know why. I don't know why I like. So I feel guilty too for some reason. Like, this was something bad that I was doing. Like, being abused? I think it's not your fault at all. You were a kid. Oh, don't worry. I know that now. Boy, do I ever. Question. Can I go kick all the butts? Like, I got experience. You can have some things up. Well, my mom's kind of old now. I still have to visit her sometimes. I have a brother, he's overseas in the army. And my dad like, left like 10 years ago. So who knows where he is, or if he's even alive. If he's alive, I don't want to know about it. I guess I just want to give you a hug forever. Well, I was lucky, luckier than not so kids. I was glad I didn't like Yeah. Anyway, to uh, the original question. Testing on my psychic abilities in the past made me really interested in both paranormal stuff and science. And I joined a skeptic society on the internet. And that kind of ruined me on a lot of other natural bull poop. And it gave me something to solve. Something you could debunk or no. I don't know, it saved me a lot of a little, I guess. Because when someone does all that stuff to you, it can like make you do some bad things to yourself. But anyway, yeah, no, I'll go to Rod. So like, I feel like if I've been through that, I'd be more likely to want to believe in God or something. Do you believe in anything at all? Like, oh well, like, so like the constellations, I don't believe there's a whale up there, but I believe that the stars exist and the pe that people put the whale there. I don't know. We're drawing lines through the space between stars, like, we're pattern finders and we'll find patterns. And we'll, like, really put our hearts and minds into it. And even if we don't mean to. So I don't believe in a universe uh, and people who do it. I keep doing that. I don't need to. Pattern finders. I feel like a lot of people don't think they find, found God. But, like, God found them. Like, when they were having bad times, like you did. Hmm. God never did. It's completely alone in the pat pantry. But a few years later, Greg did. It's like, the stars can stay up there and not give a poop about us. But, this will is pretty cool. You're pretty, you're an extremely good and smart person, Angus. I try. I know more than anyone else. Yep. Yep. Come out of here. Huh? <laughs> yeah. I'll look at him. Who? Someone's standing behind us. Jeez. Holy poop. Holy poop. What do they look like? Call or some kind of weird coat? Like a huge coat or something. Yeah, that's the ghost. More worried about being. I'm more worried about it being a living person standing in the woods, staring at us. Very bad. Well, don't panic. Follow my lead. Hey there. Up for a hike? Nice night. She's not answering. It's a little hostile, right? It's definitely a little hostile. Hey, now what you did? Hey now, saw you. Hey, well, we're running now. Can you get to the car? Yes, man. Yeah, then the handler. The car kind too. No one in heaven or earth can stop me. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Deep breaths in, out. All right. Arr! I'm even controlling this right now.
Danger! I just creeped myself out. I just creeped myself out. I don't know why I creeped myself out. Please, please. You okay, big guy? Yeah, I'll be crying in a few minutes. I'm using it. Uh, I don't. I just creeped myself out. I said, "Danger!" When the, when the dude came. <laughs> so that was it. That was the ghost. Or we it was some weird we we Eh, or we it was we some weird listen up there. They probably got lots of kids throwing parties back there. I mean, the party we went to. Where where you threw up? Uh, and I wasn't too far from there. Uh, why does nobody believe me? It's like every other explanation is more likely than ghost. Okay, fine, whatever. Sorry, grouchy headache. That was scary. It's cool. It was. Yay. This is sick. His head blocks it. <laughs> Go back in and just saw him too. Wait, come on. Mm, talk to the others. Hey, Dad. Hey, you. You okay? Uh, weird night. Look, we're run out. Uh, duck. Jeez, I'm sore tonight. You need a bad brace or something. How do you do? Do I? Run? Always running and jumping all crazy. I don't know, I mean, I'm really out of shape. I don't think I've ever been in shape. It used to be, but that was because of my job. New job doesn't require much like that, yeah. Okay, go to bed, you. Will do. Go to bed. Okay. Bedtime? Yes. Going to bed. Going to bed. Bedtime, sleepy me. Uh. Okay, this is when we're going to leave this episode of Night in the Woods right here. So, if you like it, uh, some, I don't know, I don't really have an outro that well, I don't even know if I have an outro yet. So, if you like it, thumbs up, whatever, do what you guys do, subscribe if you want to, it's free, I'll see you in the next episode, bye!